Tell us a little bit about uh, the dinners and how long they've been going. Well, they've been, they have links back to the famine times and it was officially set up then in 1888 by a group of like-minded people who just saw the need for the Irish being hungry and saw the need to feed them. And here we are in 2018. And we're still and still in need, mm -hmm. which is says something in Absolutely, itself. Absolutely, yeah. Can you tell me a rough idea of the numbers of people who come to for, for their dinner? Well, we feed about 2,000 every week, which every is week? huge for Cork, yeah. Mm -hmm. See, that's an enormous figure. Uh, that's that's, that's lunch, it's lunchtime or dinner time? Or what no, what we do is we kick off about 6 a.m. in the morning and we open the doors around 8.30, 8.45 and people are waiting for their dinner at oh. that stage. They come in and we do a four-course meal and uh, they'll come in and they'll eat it, they're hungry. And on Christmas Day you'll have, as you say, heaps of people will be there. They'll, they'll, Absolutely. You'll make it a very yeah. pleasant environment, I presume, for we them will. to eat. Yeah, and you see dinner on Christmas Day then is courtesy of the River Lee Hotel. Yeah. They'll cook and prepare it for Good us and bring it over. And we'll serve it. Yeah, that's, you're right. That's very generous. Thank you. Not everyone will do that. Yeah. And um, because of the public transport and being, being out, um, we have Michael Turtle who's going to, he's got um, limousines and buses and he'll pick everybody up, bring them to Penny Dinners that's, and that's then lovely. bring them home. And what that means is that people can actually get to Penny Dinners. For sure. You know, because if we could be too far away from some people and they rely on the public transport. So sure. with him giving his services, it means And who's works. using the service, roughly oh, speaking? Oh, well, years ago we just had, you know, like I suppose going back a good couple of years ago, it was just kind of men that were fond of the drink, so to speak. Right. No, we have everybody. We have families. We have families trying to keep a roof over their heads, yeah. families in fear of eviction. We have families that just can't pay the rent yeah. because, you know, they will struggle to pay the rent. They'll pay their bills. Then they've nothing left for food. The table always yeah. seems to suffer because if you don't keep a roof over your head, you're out in the street, mm -hmm. you'll end up homeless. And, um, and if you don't pay the bills, you know, your electricity will be cut off and things yeah. like that. But we also have families that we look after that are in hotels and B&Bs. And that's very sad for them because they're in one room and they're there a very, very long time. Mm. And to get a roof over your head, even though it is just one room, it sounds great, but to be there to have to do everything yeah. in front of each other and then to have to eat together. They have no cooking facilities. And you have a lot of volunteers so working with you there? We have amazing volunteers. Yeah, people just giving their time out on the Christmas Day. The best in the country, yeah. yeah. Okay. And like they're all geared up for Christmas yeah. Day. And we'll have a concert on Christmas Day. We'll have Santa, he'll come in from Kent Station. Yeah. And we have it, um, you know, all sorted. And it's we, you know, we have presents for everybody. Of so course, and it's important, important to say that because sometimes, yes, and so you have your kids will be watching tonight and be yeah. in circumstances that aren't fair. And they'll be wondering, does Santa come? Santa comes. Santa and comes. And he'll be there. Yeah. Uh, by, we, by hook or by crook, sure. he'll find by, you. Yeah. You know, so and don't be worried. And we make sure that. And, you know, the outpouring of love that we get in yeah. Cork is absolutely amazing because nearly everybody knows each other, other below. Sure. And it just means that nobody will go without a that's, Christmas. So that's very important. It's a lovely message.